Hello everyone, this is Didi Witcher one here once again on Jimmy Master Matronics. In this review today, I'm going to be reviewing the Jimmy Halloween Hainup um, Green Zombie Skull. Now, many characters are made in this series. As you can see, I have one over here, and I have another one over there. It's the mummy. And they made these characters for a few years. I believe they started in 2008, and they made them through 2010. And I believe this one is a 2008 model. I got this at Goodwill with my friend Will. Um, it was actually in the plush toy section, because you know, you gotta check there sometimes. And that actually says like 99 cents, I'm pretty sure it's like illegible. But sometimes they'll just write the prices on the item for some reason, which is sort of weird. But anyway, so this was basically a dollar. And I was. There was nothing in the store. I was about ready to give up, and then it's like, let's check one more time, and then I, I find this. So that was definitely worth check, a double checking there. Now, it has one issue with it, which is that the push button on the head, which is above the motion sensor, does not work. However, it works perfectly fine when it's on sensor. And this one is rather disturbing to a lot of people, just the way the face looks. You know, it's not just like a regular skull or or zombie or frog. You know, it's it's, it's this like weird head, and it's like I don't know if it's a zombie or a, a skull, like a zombie head or a skull. It's like a combination of both. It's like a, a zombie turning into a skeleton. I don't know. I'm not some like I'm not into like goth stuff, so I don't know the official terminology or whatever, but. Yeah, so, um, it also comes with, th the first models come with this clip that you can, um, use to hang it, or you can just use it with the loop, as you can see, I have I have it on a thumbtack, that gives you an idea of how heavy it is, it's not really heavy at all, and yeah, it has two phrases, the eyes light up and the mouth moves, and that is really it, and I believe it does take two AA batteries, which, if you're wondering where they go, that, if you go underneath the, the mouth there, there's a battery compartment. So that's really all I have to say about it. Oh yeah, and there's the speaker. Kind of a small speaker. And w without further ado, we will demonstrate it for you. Interesting. Okay. Don't know why I was having some problems activating there, but yeah, those are the only things it says. There's no point in me showing it to you in the dark because um, all you'll just see is red lights um, blinking at the screen. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about this item. Figured I'd review it, although it's like January. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.